Good evening, Altrincham, and welcome to a Tuesday live show with me, Chris. Woohoo! So, I'm in. I'm not going to tell you where I am because you might have to guess where I am yourselves. So, I'm just going to give you a little uh, brief on where I am and have a look. Yes, that's right, we are in hail this week, Craig. And there's just something that I need to show you if it'll actually work. Can somebody look at the prices of these houses in Bowden and hail? They look big houses for the big money. So you can actually see I've taken you all the way to Hale Village today, uh, this evening, as I've been to Timpley already, loads of times, Altrincham. Um, so I just thought I'd bring you into Hale Village because they've got Christmas lights, why not? You know, people enjoying themselves and little Christmas gifts around Hale, if you've got a bit of pennies that is. But hey, why not, we all love Hale. So anyway, I'm going to wear a little, Turn the camera around so you can enjoy hail, hail for a second or two and uh, we'll see you all sh soon. See you later. Now this is probably a better side to do it because you can see the Christmas lights a little bit better here. You can actually, they look really nice. You've got Costa in Hale as well. Oh, I love Costas. Yeah, there's, if you saw my live show on Thursday morning, you get, here's another gift in home, which is another one in Hale. Look at all these little treasures, little, little prezies. Nice as well, look at these. There's not quite a few new shops here, Joe. There's quite a few that have uh, that have stayed here for a while. <coughs> you know. But if you, there's a few places that I'd like to try out sometime. Nice little. They do like curries in there, in a uh, cook as well. And you've got the Indian rest, Indian kitchen as well, looks, looks nice and I'm looking in there, people in there ordering the food. So... This is quite strange actually. And you've, it's a nice little restaurant in that corner there. I just don't believe all these like estate agencies and house shops and things. I just love these big houses. Every time I come to Hale, there's always big houses. Just look at the size of these. They're like millions, two millions and three millions. It's like wow. And especially that one, nearly nearly two and a half million. Good God. <laughs> and then you've got nice little cute ones here in Bowden and Hale. Oh, look at these, Joe. I've even got Joe with me. Look at these. Wow. I know, it's like, I can't believe it. Just look at the size of these houses. Wow. I just love big houses. Oh, no, that's a gorgeous one. Look at that. <laughs> God, it's like, it's like through the keyhole, isn't it, tonight? <laughs> you know, it's just... Uh, uh, no, no, the tomatoes are too left. But as you can see, I'm live in Hale today. Um, I am actually making my way towards a little bit, bit of a uh, bit of difference, you know. 
but anyway you know it's like I'm trying to improve live shows during the week on on my on my own like the Chris walk around um, and also um, I'm trying to update quite a lot of uh, lives on Tuesdays and Thursdays on my own uh, Andy is trying to do his best with his lives on a Wednesday and also Sundays will stay the same there's a lot going on there really is a lot going on and I'm just like wow hang on a minute I'm just just going to turn the camera around because people can have a look around where I am there you go you've got the do you remember when Victoria Wines they used to have a Victoria Wines in Hale didn't they I used to love it. <laughs> I didn't really, but then again, that's where the booze is. Oh, Laura! So I just walked past the girl. Laura, you should have come and said hello. It would be nice, actually, if you come and say hello to the camera, like, like Joanne did last week. She made, she um, gave up her uh, pudding to come and say hello. If you can follow the camera, I'll stop on my way. Woo! I'm just waiting outside the um, oh the Midlands. Is it? Oh God! Yeah, it's a bit quiet out there tonight. Right, I'm just I'm just walking towards the cam the uh, the camera, the clock. So I'm just. Uh, As you can see, we've got... Oh my god, this feels strange. Oh god. You've even got like the... Uh, train station. You've just missed the train, actually. Oh yeah, there's there. <laughs> oh god. Right, yeah, I can see something now. Just there. Uh, <coughs> I think. Just there. Uh, <laughs> I think. As you. <laughs> hey. Hey, yeah. Hey, right, look, we've got some more people Please wanting to say hello. Sorry. Hey, look, we've got another mate. Woo, another one. What's your name? Andy. Oh, Andy, this is an Andy. Andy, there's another Andy. Yeah. And this is Laura. Hi, Laura. Yeah. <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> hey, it's, look, it's like being back in the studio again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, nice oh, nice to meet you guys. You Thank you so much. Thank you. Woo! That's what we need. Woo! <laughs> Thank you. Enjoy your evening. <laughs> oh, wow. That's brilliant, that, isn't it? People to come to talking to me while I'm live on the street. I like that. I really like that. Nice to meet you too, Andy and Laura. Oh my god, that was fantastic. Sorry, I just get me overwhelmed. People, more people coming up towards me, actually doing that to me. It's like, whoa. That's what I like to see every live show I do. That is fantastic. And sorry, we've even got Joe with me tonight, and I'm running off. I'm just excited. One minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh god anyway i'm just gonna turn the camera around you know <laughs> oh no <laughs> oh and you've got you've got the uh canada grill as well yeah i don't know about that one god even people over the talk this i can't believe that andy and louise fantastic people oh and then now you've got the way away in. The way away.
No, I'm not going in the railway. It's all right. It's full. I don't want to go in there tonight. Look at that. I can't believe it. That was a surprise tonight. I, I, I keep going though. My live show is not going anywhere just yet. I, I'm making me, making our way round to uh, Altrincham now. At the uh, oh beep beep. So I'm just gonna is look at all the look at these little sparkling shops. That's another one, isn't it? It's a very nice sparkly shop in Hale. And you've got another restaurant in Hale. There's a lot of restaurants. That was just fantastic. Thank you so much to Andy and Louie, uh, Louie, uh, Laura that have uh, come and said hello live on Altrincham News tonight. That I can't believe it. it was like last week. You've got, you've got, um, you got Joe from Bistro Pierre, which she was having her lunch, her, her. Uh, her evening meal while I was live and then she came out in the middle of it that was that was even special thank you for that uh, you were great doing that I appreciate that don't we Joe we, we appreciate people coming out mm -hmm. see we've got quiet Joe on me but it's right we, we normally go out on a Tuesday so Anyway, I'm just making heading out of of hail now. <coughs> oh wow, this is so brilliant that I can't believe it. Really good life tonight. <laughs> oh no. Right, yeah, let's go down there. Yeah, let's stay on this side now. Oh. Although I am actually looking for people to follow me, well, side by side, because um, I'm just trying to make Altingham News a little bit better than it is because a lot of changes are happening and I'm looking to progress on my side like Andy's got his side so it's not just Andy on this side you know what I mean um, so yeah so where I am at the moment I'm just you've got like Bowden Hotel and if you go up there, you've got like the Griffin and the Stone, the Stamford. So if you can actually see, and Andy's already online already, writing a message. Um, yeah, to contact myself, it's chris at altrincham.news. Um, I'm available at any time, just uh, not evenings mostly, because I do work as well more than Altrincham News. But even so, I'm trying to build that up with Andy. <laughs> oh yeah, I've got a Twitter account as well, it's called Woohoo Chris. But anyway... Um, I'm just trying. This is Ashley Road or Stamford New, something like that. Joanne knows it. I, I've only, I've only lived here for about three months up this road. But anyway, you might notice that where you, where I am. Because.
but while I'm walking though, there is there is quite a lot I want to say tonight, but there's only so much I can say because we're trying to make Altingham, Altingham news really fun. We're not professional, as Andy says we're not, so I'm not being professional, I'm just not going on that route. Um, so I'm not, fair dues. But, you know, um, anyway, as I, at the moment I do, it is nearly Christmas though, that's, what, that's another thing I'll come on towards in the next few weeks, because it's nearly Christmas. Um, I might have to get myself a Christmas hat. Jo's texting away, so she's not following me. Um, keep it fun, yeah, thanks Susan, like you told me to today, yeah, thank you very much for that. Um, I do appreciate the support from a few of my friends, um, but Altingham News is just fun. Quite a lot of fun, really. You know, quite a lot that goes on by backstage, which is a bit harsh at the moment towards me, but even so, I can't just... I can't just grow up kind of because I'm I'm a funny guy I just enjoy what I do and people enjoy what I do but even so even so I can't I can't I can't make everyone happy can I but you know keep it fun that's what Altrincham News is about it's all fun and about Altrincham oh thank you <laughs> I look like Liam Gallagher in it, yo. <laughs> oh, thank you. Well, I didn't, I, I didn't intend to look like Liam Gallagher, but it's from Branded, and this this jacket was twenty four ninety nine, and it was from Branded in Altrincham. So if you want one, you can go and get one. But don't worry, it's just just don't copy me. Otherwise, I will tell you not to copy me. There's a lot of co- people that do copy me around Altrincham. Um, well, that was last year and early early this year, but I'm not going down that route. But even so, even so. But anyway, I'm going to carry on because we're we're just heading on, heading towards Alt- a little bit to Altrincham now. Um, so I will uh, give you a little tour on there. But I do appreciate I do appreciate uh, the support on Altrincham News and people enjoying our post. Even though some posts do get removed, that's not me. People don't like what I post, so uh, I'm just trying to please everyone. Because um, everyone enjoys, people know it's me. So anyway, I'm going to turn the camera around for a, or a second or two while, while I uh, talk to Jo, well, wherever she is. But I'll uh, wait for a second. Enjoy the little uh, walk around for a second. Behind that darkness there's a church there, I think it's St John's Church, it's a lovely building and it's for sale as well, I wish I won the lottery, make it into a nice little place for Joanne's art place, because yeah, we know what we mean by that. So if you can see now we're, we're walking into Altrincham, um, so I'll, I'll just show you a few lights and what's going on, on around here I think. <laughs> It's quite strange. But and just to let you all know, there is twenty days only till Christmas Day. Woohoo! Christmas Day. <laughs> oh, it's so funny there. So really on the 
And straight in front of you there, you've got the Oxford Cafe. Has anyone been there? The Oxford, Caf Oxford Road Cafe. Um, we have something to share to you if you do. I'll uh, message it you if you message me. Um, something that we found on the, online the other week, the other day. But anyway, as you can see, we've got Altrincham. Welcome to Altrincham. Oh no, it says Merry Christmas, Altrincham. We. Wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Oh no, I just, I just thought of a song that came into my head, you know. Oh look, you've got the weather spoons, you've got the unicorn. You've got a few places here that I don't know because I don't go in there. Sorry. Yeah, so if you're in the unicorn, say hi. Yeah. People like running today. And then you've got the downs up there as well. You've got Stamford New Road, and then you've got Lloyd Street. Oh yeah, that was another thing guys, can you please share this video tonight, because let's, let's get Altrincham out there tonight, come on guys. We've got Altrincham Hospital. I thought that noise was something else, then, you know? And you can see all things like Christmas lights. Oh, hee hee. Somebody's coming out of the shop. You've got cost cutters now as well. That's a new one as well. And now you've got toast as well. So it's not too bad tonight, this evening in Altrincham. Um, so, if you're travelling around Altrincham tonight, hi everyone. <laughs> so you've come into from Hale to straight into Altrincham. So that's quite a good tour. So I will. You've got the tavern on the green as well. The Altrincham News local. You might see Andy in there, getting peel peeled in there. Um, you know. And also, if people want to know where Open Studios is, there's Open Studios. So you can see we've got Stamford New Road, Open Studios, and you've got the two brothers there as well, that's a coffee cafe. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Do you not really fancy? I thought, oh, I know where I fancy going. Oh, yeah. Oh. I've just found my favourite. I'm going to, going to walk past my favourite coffee shop in Altrincham. Is anyone ready? Are we ready? Ooh. Woohoo! So, here you go, you've got rustics as well. That's a nice little bar as well. And you've got the hairdressers. Oh, now look at this. Yeah, this, this is where uh, the slug and lettuce was. They're going to rent it out as a full building, not two buildings. So make sure you've got a good a good business to open that next time. Oh, oh, and now look at this. This is Grand Tees. This is my. Oh, it's closed. What's going on? It's closed. Oh, they're closed at seven o'clock. It used to be nine o'clock outside Grand Tees. Wow, they've changed the time. It used to be seven till nine at night. Wow. You know, it's quite a lot of changed, you know. Anyway, they enjoy the time. Anyway, Chris and his uh, family do actually spend a lot of time uh, preparing everyone's dinners and teas and coffees all day and stuff. So that's it for them. So, yeah, just crossing over and stamp for New Road. <laughs> no, we cannot say hell a woohoo to Richard Thomas. <laughs> Richard Thomas trained, trained the bells at the bells. Anyway, yeah, so now you, you can, we're just going down Cross Street in Altrincham. But we've also, this is new to our little walk around this week as well. We've got Warren's Bakery. The, aren't, aren't the, uh, aren't the, uh, the pasty's gorgeous in there, Cornish pasties. Yeah, the Cornish pasties in, in Warren's Bakery in Altrincham are absolutely gorgeous! Gorgeous! And now you've got um, uh, Bistro Pierre, which they have lovely meals. Hi guys, if you w enjoy your meals. Um, so, I will go down here in, uh, in the Stamford Quarter now. We've got Marks and Spencers. They're changing all the time. So It was quite it was quite strange on Saturday if you watch back because we did two live shows on Saturday with the Lantern Parade they, they did uh, this massive uh, Lantern Parade for Altering which is a new one by Altering um, Unlimited which were a fab team by the way um, so I'm just going to uh, turn the camera back and uh, enjoy what we're doing it's Christmas woohoo Yeah, it's very strange here tonight, isn't it? Can we say a woohoo to Richard Thomas, trains at Bells? All right. Mm, got Costas, look at that. One of my favorite coffee, coffee shops in Altrincham as well. I have, I have a few. Oh, people are running around the Christmas tree. And you've got Jake's shoes as well. Has anyone been in there? 
Look at these shoes. Yeah, and you've got the Altingham Today magazine, which is fantastic. As well. There's not a lot going on in Altingham tonight, is there? It's very, very uh, quiet, and you've only got the guy from Altingham News, and Joe, of course, as well. She's part of my team. Um, but there's quite a lot going on around there as well. So, I'm going to give you a little, a little, ooh, ooh. No, it's strange. But anyway, I'm just going to turn the camera around because I'll give you, I'm going to finish somewhere. I want to finish somewhere. Ah, I know I'll finish. Yeah, look, this is an empty building. What would you like to see in Old Tringham happen? That's another shop. I think it's going to be too small that now for a Primark. Well, Old Tringham doesn't need a Primark. It's going to stay in Manchester or the Trafford Centre. <laughs> oh, you've got Rackham's as well. They're still here. They've been here for years. Absolutely years. So as you can see, um, I will be drawing my live show to a close in a second, guys. But as you can see, um, it's freezing out here tonight and I do appreciate people watching me and enjoy what I do. And thank you for the support as well tonight. I appreciate it. Um, I will be going live again um, on Thursday morning at 9 o'clock. I'm not sure where yet, but if you'd like to change that, please email me at chris at altrincham.news and also contact me by Twitter by one Chris Oldfield and there's another one as well which Andy's sorted out for Altrincham for me but thank you very much Altrincham and I'll see you very very soon and have a good day tomorrow and a good evening tonight so that was me saying that night Joe we'll see you very soon Altrincham good night